What is up my beautiful people? Welcome back to another video with your girl Pamela Janani. Welcome back to my channel. What is the vibe my beautiful tribe? Happy Thursday. Let's tap into this energy because it's good. It's good. Um, push that subscription button. Um, give me a thumbs up right now before you watch. I'm going to take a second. Boom. A second. Thank you so much. Um, let's tap into it guys. You understood the assignment. You understood the assignment. And I'm telling you this, but God is telling you this. You understood the assignment, all right? Let's go. Perfectly, all right? Raise your vibrations. You have raised your vibrations. What? You raised your vibrations. If you're a spiritual woman or a man of God, you know what it is. Raising your vibrations is important to transmute any of this darkness that people and the world tries to throw at you. You guys have raised your vibrations. If not, keep raising them, all right? You said F you beep, to the haters, to your enemies. You know what I mean? You're no longer caring about what they think or how they feel about you or who they turned against you. You no longer care. You know what I'm saying? Stay woke. Stay non-superficial. Stay woke. Stay non-superficial. It's nice to have nice things. Absolutely. I'm walking into my abundance right now. My kids and I walking, skipping, running into my our abundance. Okay. For that house, for that new SUV, for that business, for those opportunities, for my loving partner and so much more. I'm skipping, running, and I'm excited for my new opportunities my new love, my new love and all of these things because I am non-superficial. I don't need these things to show off because I can have a lot, but I'm not going to make it, I'm not going to flash it and, and try to flex on any other social media platform at all. Do you know what I'm saying? God is saying to all of his people, stay non-superficial. When you turn to the lifestyle of, I got to have this name brand, I got to have this look, I want people to see me in this light, that is when you suffer in silence. And the only reason why you watching are not suffering in silence is because you are not superficial. And God is saying, stay that way. Because God is saying, I'm going to bless you to be able to afford all that you want, all that you need. And I want you to remain non-superficial. Because that's how you keep it. Do you know what I'm saying? Let's, let's tap into it some more. You understood the assignment. You stay connected to God's people, to God's resources. You stay connected to him. And they didn't. And when you don't, you fall. This isn't a true, um, I'm sorry, this isn't a time to be of the flesh, but tapped into, solely tapped into the spirit. Elevations means, elevation means awareness, right? Of the real and of the false reality that is served to us. Elevation is knowing what is real. And elevation is knowing what is also fake so that you are not going to intertwine the two, okay? Because when you intertwine the two, there's no balance. There's no correlation. There's no connection. You do not thrive. Do you know what I'm saying? And anything that you make, you lose. You know what I'm saying? Let's tap into it some more. Um, we belong to this world. And as I said before, these people who are witchy and demonic and evil spirited and so much more, they don't belong here. They did belong here. And I'm hoping that they still belong here, but a lot of them are showing that they don't belong here. You know what I'm saying? Protect your energy, protect your happiness. Okay. The peace they want to steal, even if they did steal it, they have no use of it. Your enemy wants your peace. They want your happiness. They want your wealth. They want so much from you. But even if they got what is yours, they wouldn't know how to use it. And the key here is, is that they can't and they won't be able to, able to take it. But the key is, is that they want to. And this is when you know the reality and you know the false reality of what's real, what they want to be real, and what never will come to be. Because they don't understand that what they want will never come to be. This is why they keep trying and trying and trying, same result, and then they try again. They're foolish people, right? They can't. Um, it doesn't belong in, in the body of a person, okay, uh, in, in the state of mind, in the state that your enemies are in. Your energy, your light, it doesn't belong in their body because their mind, nothing about them is elevating. Nothing at all. Nothing. The light that you have inside of you is meant to go, 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 prosper and so much more. And even if it was in their body, they wouldn't know what to do with it. It will be stagnant and it will, it will just rot. We're not made the same. You're not made the same. They can want what you want 
they can want what you have all they want but it never will show up in the face of them it never will show up in their lives as it's showing up in yours and in your face and in your light you know what i'm saying be very proud of who you are live laugh love and thrive let your enemies cry in a river of their own gasoline of tears because the more and more, as I said before in another video, that they continue on doing these things, okay? The more and more their tears that they cry, that they will try to tell you that they don't cry, is nothing but fuel. And it's going to take them to, to have one strike from God that is going to spark up a flame in their lives. And they are going to be caught on fire in the spirit. And I told in another video, watch my other videos today. When you're burning in the spirit... And even if you're walking in the flesh and it seems like you're all good, but the spirit is on fire, game over. It's game over for a lot of your enemies. They keep going. They need to stop. They light themselves up. Every time they come for you, every single time they come for you, they get lit up. And it takes one strike for them to be on. You guys get what I'm saying? Love and light, guys. That is it for this video. I hope that it resonated, gave you confirmation, okay? Continue to be you. Live, live, live abundantly and so much more. Keep your eyes on God. He is great. Jesus Christ is great. Love you guys so much. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Once again, I'll see you guys in the next message. Bye.